The jewellery feels like a process of thoughts. Making quite abstract thoughts into something that you can hold, something real. It normally starts with just an idea of a sensation. Wind in the grass, rain falling, trying to make something that has the movement or the light or something reminiscent of that feeling. We're in Somerset in southwest England. I find inspiration every day in, in the walks that I do and it's the sort of peaceful countryside. I think with the jewellery I'm continuing the same ideas that I worked with in sculpture and in drawing and in painting, but changing the medium to working in gold. So we've got six colours that we're working with. They're all 18 to 24 karat gold, but alloyed with different metals so that we've got different colours. I think gold to me feels like it's got a kind of soul as a material. I hope that you sense in the jewellery the time that is taken. The process of sitting and doing for hours, making the little shapes, making changes to the form and, and adjusting as we go along. I'm never happier than when I'm actually making pieces, focusing on these tiny details of the tiny curve on one piece of hundreds that are on a necklace. I lose myself in it. <laughs>